under one feet, millions of life forms live in the soil. The soil biota spans from fungi, bacteria, nematode, and insects, among which nematodes are the most metazoans of the planet, contributing nearly 13 to 17 percent of the total microflora. Nematodes that cause disease and death of insects with help of symbiotic bacteria is called as entomopathogenic nematodes. And heterohabditis and Steiner nema are the commercially exploited entomopathogenic nematodes across the globe. Heterohabditis roams in the soil in its third juvenile stage. This is the only stage in which the entomopathogenic nematode survives outside the host where they won't feed, doesn't reproduce, and don't develop during this stage. At this stage, it is known as Doer larvae. Heterohabditis utilizes the cruiser foraging mechanism and locates the host. The doer stage is released and the third juvenile stages invades the host through natural openings or by piercing the cuticle. After entering the host, they break the insect's midgut and enters into the hemocell. It takes 3 to 4 hours to reach the hemocell when entering through natural openings, but it just takes 30 minutes to 1 hour when entered through cuticle. Once the juvenile enters the hemocell, Heterorabditis releases monospecific symbiotic bacteria lined in their anterior portion of the nematode's gut. Once the gram nematode bacteria is released, the bacteria multiplies rapidly and plays an important role in suppressing the insect's immune system. Heterorabditis utilizes the host nutrients efficiently and completes 2 to 3 generations within the host in 8 to 10 days. The insect gets killed within 24 to 72 hours of infection. Once the nutrient source is diminished, 1.5 lakh fresh infective juveniles are released into the soil and they start searching for a new host.